the morning vlog it is um about to be one o'clock this is like the exact same time i started my vlog yesterday it's weird um anyways i don't have a shirt on you might have been able to tell in the mirror behind me in that when i before i turned around um anyways la 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 what am I doing today? I have the day off. Courtney wants to go to abandoned water park. And, um, looks like I'm probably gonna, we're gonna be going to do that. She gets off work. She got off work 15 minutes ago. She has to go home and get ready. And so I need to get ready. And then we're going. I'm excited. I think it's in, like, Westfield or something. I don't know. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go to that because it's like 60 degrees out today. Welcome to Indiana where the weather has no idea what it ever wants to do. And then I need to, after that I have to edit a video. So today won't be like uber exciting, but the water park might be cool. I'm excited. I'm gonna take my camera and like take like actual good pictures of it maybe. Okay, that's all. So I just finished doing my makeup and I'm I got dressed and I want to be comfy today, but I don't know if I can handle this. Excuse the really loud commercial in the background. I'm just going to pause this until the commercial's over. Hold on. Okay, that commercial was really loud. Anyways, it feels weird. Like, I just, I have on Love Costs Everything t-shirt and black leggings, and it's so weird. Time to do my hair. Okay, so we can't get to the abandoned... Here's Courtney. Hello. <laughs> we can't get to the abandoned um, water park thing. It's called Thunder Island, and I guess you can't get there anymore because of the way they redid the road, so traffic, like highway traffic, is in the way. <laughs> That's lame. But, so we're going to um, go geocaching. Yeah. Is it supposed to rain? I don't know. Um, I read the forecast and it said maybe, but it hasn't yet. So, well, we might turn into wet dogs by we'll the end of out. this vlog. Yes. Yay! I'm so excited. I've never done this before. Um, so, have you ever done it before? Yes, I did it a couple times last year. <laughs> I'm excited. So, basically, what is geocaching for people who don't know? Basically, what you do is people hide like little trinkets and like little notes and stuff around in these areas, and you have to like navigate it and search for it. And when you find it, you leave your name and the date that you found it, and then you put it back for other people to find. Or sometimes you can leave like your own little trinkets in there, and people mm -hmm. will find it. Or you can start leaving your own caches, put them in a secret place, write like either directions to it, or you can also like do the like cryptic things where you have to figure out what it says with like. It's really cool. It's really we're cool. We're gonna have fun with this. I'm so excited. So yeah, we're gonna go geocaching. Here we go. We don't know where we're going yet. We haven't. We have no idea where we're going. She's downloading an app right now. Okay, so we are at this pond. Oh, we're with Jesse now too. <laughs> we're at this pond. There are lots of ducks. It's windy. Courtney has a compass on her phone and we're hopefully gonna find one. We just found another one. Well, the first one. Because Courtney had already found it before, she just wanted to like show me what it looked like so that I kind of knew. And now we're on the hunt. She has a compass on her phone. I feel like we're on Pirates of the Caribbean. <laughs> but why is the rum always gone? <laughs> I feel like I should be acting like All drunken. <laughs> we are with first mate Gray. <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay, so Jessie's showing me a meter with her feet. <laughs> Okay, so we're by another pond now, and Courtney's phone is like talking to us and telling us that we're close, but we're not. I don't know what's going on. And it's telling us in meters, and I don't know what a meter is. <laughs> I'm American! <laughs> it's. You know, it might be on that other side. But it's not, it's not saying the right o'clock for that. <laughs> she looked at me like, shut up. <laughs> Is there a pond over there? On like the other side of the houses, maybe? <laughs> You're on top of it, apparently. <laughs> Two o'clock, zero meters. Two o'clock, zero. Is it buried? Dig! I don't think so. Where's shovel? the shovel? <laughs> but it literally said it's not buried. It's like, this one's a bust. <laughs> this sucks. So Cordy downloaded another app and it brought us back to the exact same place except it's over here somewhere so these 
Jesse's. There's those two. <laughs> Jesse's about to die. And we're gonna look again. So here we go. Update. Courtney thinks it was not in that bush and we're just at the wrong place. Okay, so we found one. Let's see what it looks like. This is it. We just spent... Please, please do not disturb the game piece. We just spent forever trying to find it. And uh, I downloaded an app too and it took us to like right here. It's way off the ground. And then it was literally right here underneath this tree. Right outside the fence. That's along the whole thing. Oh, you dropped the... I dropped the pen. The pencil. The pencil. Okay, what's in it? Okay, let's see what we got. That. <laughs> Business that. card. Business card. Great times ticket. Auto sales. Honest Abe auto sales the fourth. <laughs> Excellent. Wow. I got something to sign. Oh, I'm Courtney! <laughs> Courtney ruins everything. I don't have a trinket. Just kidding, that Courtney. Was harsh. <laughs> I know, I'm just kidding. Not everything. Just, just most almost. things. <laughs> she said just almost. What's that, Co? For us to sign. Oh. Oh, Congratulations, you found it. Intentionally or not. <laughs> Yay, we found one. We can sign it, Jess, if you want to. So we signed it and we go? put it back. Um, we went Here it is. If you're ever on remember. Emerson, we put it right back <laughs> there. They probably like buried it in the dirt a little bit. It was literally like... That's how I saw it. It was like that. I, we done found our first geocache. My first geocache. I saw the green. <laughs> so we drove down the road a little bit and found another. Well, Jesse found this one. Yay! Good job. It was under, it was under this it thing. Was under this. Yay! <laughs> I do. Yeah, Jesse does. Okay, you found it. So you, you can, can tell we live in the city. Obviously. Yeah. All those sirens. Yeah. People being stupid. Yay! Mad. We found another. Now. <laughs> Here comes the night. Somebody found this two days ago. An ambulance, I think. Number one dangerous city in the world. Top, right now. top murder rate in the country. In the country, not the world. <laughs> We're in Detroit. I don't understand that. I don't either. Like this place it's is Indiana. Not the, but you know, people have like talked about Detroit. I mean, don't forget for Detroit. your phone. Also, this egg was like right next to it. That's creepy. We're at McAllister's now. Here's my food. Here's Courtney, and she got a plate of pickles for us. I did. <laughs> Yay. What'd you get, Jess? What's your um, sandwich? The Italian. Yummy. It has a whole bunch of It's raining out. And here we have a giant dinosaur. And Courtney. <laughs> I always look awful in your videos. <laughs> Everybody does, it's fine. Everyone's always like, I make the stupid Back home now watching Walking Dead. Mid season finale. So oh my god. Anna's mom tweeted Mo and Aho and said, Merry Christmas, looks like Mo and Aho have row five to One Direction. And this happened about a half hour ago, and I didn't know if she was lying or not. So I called Anna, and she didn't answer her phone, and I'm trying not to cry right now. She didn't answer her phone, and so I called Tanner, which is Anna's boyfriend for anyone who doesn't know. And, uh, and I was like, trying so hard not to cry that he thought I was like he like you know like when you sound like you're like you're off you're like crying but you just don't have tears running down yet and you're like holding it in you're like can I just okay so that happened and uh <laughs> oh my god oh my god anyways I so I called Tanner because Anna didn't answer and he um he could tell that I was crying and he was like, I was like, can I just talk to Anna? I was like asking him stuff and I was just like, can I just talk to Anna? And he was like, yeah, here. Like he thought I was like something like someone died or something. 
and um then I got on the phone with Anna and she had no idea either because they were just like watching a movie or something and she didn't have her phone on her and so long story short we have tickets to see One Direction and they're basically like on the field and it's here and oh my god I'm gonna cry again I'm so excited I like bawled on when I told Anna when I finally like got it out I was like we have row five in One Direction and I just started like bawling and it I'm so excited oh my god okay so I just needed to update my vlog because oh my god um so yeah that happened I'm back from Courtney hanging out with Jess and Courtney because I have to work in the morning they went back to Jesse's house because uh they're gonna make cookies and stuff and I wanted to go but I have to work at like 8 in the morning and I didn't want to um I don't want to have to, like, get up super early over there. And I know I'd be going to bed super late there. It's already midnight here, so I'm already screwed. But, oh, my God, I'm so excited. Oh, my God. So, anyways, that's what I'm doing currently. I am I need to calm myself down so I can go to bed because I have to be work in seven hours. Six and a half hours. But, um... Um, so yeah, now me and Anna are texting each other about our concert and like what we're going to wear and like all that stuff. So anyways, I guess that's the end of the vlog because I'm going to be doing nothing but fangirling over my life right now because it's going so perfectly. Um, knock on wood. Whew, okay, so good night vlog. I will see you tomorrow. I'm going to see One Direction.